Hello everybody, and welcome to my run of Super Meat Boy. This time, it's the end. So in this world, um, I'm pretty sure it's the only world that has a Dark World version of the boss, so I'm also going to be doing that as well. Now this world only has five actual levels, so hopefully this won't take me very long. I think the levels are basically designed to um, test like everything that you've learned up until this point. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, so far so good. I think in part one I said it's just all about avoiding souls. That statement's never been more true. That is all it is. And it's all it ever will be. to do this. Oh, there we go. I, I thought it was like that, but when I tested it, I couldn't remember. Okay, and then back again. Ah, I knew that that was going to happen. I panicked. Well, rather die there than where I died last time. Damn it. This is actually quite easy. You know what, I've said that on every part, really. Weirdly, I think the hardest world for me has been um, uh, the Salt Factory, and I don't remember that being hard at all. Okay, let's just get this one. Right. Die here. That'd be a travesty. Almost did. Oh, crap. Ah, I should have just have gone with the flow, right. Crap. Right, okay. We're gonna do this. Yes. Okay. Onward to victory. That was not victory. Well. Just jump for it. Oh dear. That was close. Yeah, what? Let's just get here first. Dodgy platforming sections. Oh no. Ah. Uh, that was annoying. I thought I got out of the like, little entrance thing and I had not No. Oh god, I could have just stayed still then, what happened? Ah! A 
Landing precise jumps sometimes feels a little bit awkward in this game. Probably on purpose, but it's because you're so slippery. Right, <clears throat> this looks fairly simple. Now it's just a matter of getting back. Which, in theory, is easy. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Right. Ah. You can just... If you time it right, you can just like... Oh. You can just slide up that wall. What am I doing? I'm alright in this corner. No panic. Panic. That big saw is in the wrong place at the wrong time. Then feel free to panic. Oh my god, right, yeah, that was annoying. I keep thinking I'm getting past the stores and clipping them at the end of my jumps. We shall succeed. Why did I do that? You see, now I'm dead. Because I went too far. Oh, I'm not dead. I will be dead. No, I won't. Okay. Well, I probably will still, but... Yeah, I knew it. I haven't practiced that. I didn't think I was going to do it anymore. Oh, jeez. Jeez. Right, okay. Oh my god, right, yep. Yeah. I can stay there on the right and I'll be safe. I hate that. I, I hate that. Oh god damn it, this isn't even hard. Why am I dying here? That was just bad. Ooh. We're doing this. Oh, oh dear, that's the problem with staying on the right. The big sun comes around and it just lagged. Why do I always do this? Why do I always make it difficult for myself when I go too fast? Let's 
Let's see if I can make it through these now. Alright, okay. <clears throat> so far, so good. Oh, crap. <laughs> Oh no, that was just bad. I saw that coming from a mile away, and yet yeah, it still happened. Again, going too fast, it can just put you in some really awkward situations. I feel more comfortable <coughs> jumping forward. Those saws. There we go. Ooh. <clears throat> no. Oh god, why did I do that? <clears throat> Oh my god, oh my god, that was just bad. Messed that up from the beginning, really. Ooh! Big saw just caught me out there. Ooh, and again. And the big saw's gonna be coming around. Okay, good. Excellent, I actually think I did that quite a lot faster. Oh, what a stupid mistake to make. It's not that beginner stuff. Oh, again, but if, if things aren't in the right positions at the right times, pretty much just dead. stuck between those two big saws. <clears throat> no, oh my god. I'm trying to jump above that second big saw. So that makes it a lot easier. I just got caught out by that then. There's the big saw. Oh my god. Such stupid mistakes.
realised how hard I press this trigger down. It actually hurts my finger a little bit when I pay attention to it. There we go. Oh. Right, <clears throat> so then it's just the same thing again. Like trying to jump above that big saw there. It's harder this time, I think. So... Oh god, that's... It's not, it's not hard, it's just... You need a couple of tries to, like, realise... The exact route you need to take. Literally, all I need to do is time this, so I go over that big saw. So this time, like that, perfect. Right, that's not what I intended to do, but it all doesn't matter. It will do. Hey. Oh, what? I fell down into that. Oh, you're kidding me. Right, right. I'm, I just need to go for it. <clears throat> I'm overthinking it again. the lag's fault, not mine. I can blame at least two of these deaths on things other than me. Right. Now I could go about this an easy way. No. I tried to do it in a more difficult way. Didn't work out. Right. You know what, I am gonna try that again, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there we go. Right. Ooh. Wasn't sure what I needed to do then, I started panicking a little bit. Right. Now this could be a pain in the ass. itself. Uh, well. Well, that was good. The game minimised itself for some reason. Just as I was at the end, it had to do it then. It couldn't have done it when I was, like, at the beginning or something. Damn it! I would have done it then. In a parallel universe, I've completed this by now. Oh, you're kidding me. That was such an easy jump to make and I messed up the end. close to that so right ah I went a little bit too fast damn you see I made that first time and then it crashed what 
the hell is that? Annoying, that's what it is. That only is a little bit annoying. Now this, that right there, even though it doesn't look it, that's one of the hardest jumps in the game. Did it. Now I'm going to do the boss, the Dark World version of the boss. <clears throat> I have, I don't really remember this stage, I'll be honest. Right. Oh crap. I must be thinking of the light. Oh, why didn't I even jump? <clears throat> the light world version of that bit, I think you need to go around the top and it put me off. Oh. Oh yeah. His rockets are really annoying, because the explosion after the rocket can kill you, even though it doesn't really look like it can. Oh, I've failed. Yeah, I wasn't going anywhere near this. Right, Providing I don't die stupidly. Ah, oh, that was close. Okay, good. Right. I've finally rescued Bandage Girl. Harry, uh, Harry's run. <coughs> uh, yeah, I think he's watching all the cutscenes, so I might as well just skip them. I died. I'm not sure if I'm gonna actually be able to do the Cotton Alley. Because, well, I could, and I could record it, but it would take a long time, probably. Like, I'm probably take around three hours and it would just get a bit boring. So I'm actually, oh damn it, so I'm actually thinking about just not doing the Cotton Alley. But I'll see. I don't know. Ah, you need to do that a lot faster. Okay. Oh, damn it. I don't even know what the hell I was trying to do then. What am I doing? Come on. This is silly. Seriously, what the hell? Oh, bloody hell. Right. 
that. There we go. Now this. Right. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> that was weird. Right, okay. Um Why 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 did it Oh damn it. You need to get really fast at that bit. It's probably the fastest obstacle in the entire game, though. Why I'm dying on this bit, really? No, 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 I wasn't fast enough. That might have been, yeah, it was. Good. That's really, really tense, that bit. This bit might not look it, but this is actually a little bit hard to time. Right, I did it. Oh my god. <laughs> right. Whew. Psyching myself up for this. I have got past the hard part. Like this isn't this really isn't that hard. If I die now it'll just be because I'm I didn't. Right. Okay, very good. Yeah. So yeah, that's super meat boy. Like I was saying, there is another world, um, the Cotton Alley where you play as Bandage Girl, but it is very, very hard, and I'm not sure how long it would actually take me to do. I mean, this took me a long time. That would just take me ages. I will go through all the credits, because why not, really? Might as well. Hey, John Blow. The developer of Brave. Which is probably another game me and Harry, me or Harry, will probably play in the future of Brood. I think Harry should play it, he'll get pretty stuck on that. I think. I think he has played a bit of it, but he's not got to the really, really difficult, well, I say really, really difficult, but difficult levels there. That's not over exaggerated, it's not that hard. And to be honest, this isn't that hard. I think this is kind of over exaggerated in its difficulty as well. What a lovely ending. So yeah, Dr. Fetus is dead. So yeah, the Cotton Alley, it, it's very hard. I'd say the Light World uh, is probably as hard as the hardest Dark World so far. I haven't even, I haven't even done the Dark World yet. But yeah. I don't know if there's going to be a next part, but if not, I'll see you on another game. Bye!